Meanwhile, a Tucson man is dead after a horrific bear attack just outside of Prescott, and we are now learning the victim's name. The Yavapai County Sheriff's Department has identified the Tucsonan as 66-year-old Stephen Jackson. It happened just before 8 a.m. in the area known as Groom Creek, and that is where Jackson was apparently sitting while having a cup of coffee at a table on his property when the 300-pound male black bear attacked him. Mark Hart from Arizona Game and Fish's department describes the attack. He was apparently building a cabin in a relatively remote area south of town. He was attacked from behind by the bear. There was a struggle. Neighbors heard his cries for help, and one of them killed the bear with a rifle. Officials also say the attack appeared to be predatory and unprovoked. The last time a bear has attacked and killed a person in our state was back in 2011. And this attack in particular has left Hart looking for answers. But typically there's a precursor to an attack. Bear stands up on its hind legs, huffs, maybe bluff charges. But to just attack a guy outright from behind for no apparent reason, we need to understand what happened there.